Hello everyone, this is Yakuro with another UE4 tutorial. In this episode, we will look into the U property macro and cover the simple display and advanced display proper, uh, specifier. Let's make an example before I start explaining it. I will create here two properties edit anywhere for both so we are able to modify it uh, let's say a float again energy level and the other one uh, is an integer and says something about the max damage so the deeper meaning of, about those variables doesn't matter here for now. It's just I want to show you how those two specifiers are used. Let's compile this. Um, if you remember, so in the details panel of the blueprint editor, you'll see uh, the de so the details section and then there are always those small arrows where you can click and then there comes uh, another field with other properties so this is our actor let's look here uh, no where is it my actor here energy level and max damage so this is the normal part um, where those properties are visualized and uh, w what I meant is those arrows here if you click that you see there is another property now in this replication section and this is called the advanced section so if you specify here which is actually the default simple display you will get the same the same result let's say uh, at the same result as it is here let's say the energy level is something which the blueprint programmer should change a lot and this max damage is more or less fixed and should be kind of hidden in this advanced field and you do that in specifying here advanced display and if you compile you will see that now the max damage will disappear we will get an error here and if we click here you we can see our property now and as I said the default is simple display so you don't have to explicitly specify that I'm not sure in which cases you have to specify it explicitly but I would assume you don't have to but if someone knows about that more uh, please uh, feel free to leave a comment here so we can all learn how the simple display is used so to me at least that is the default case if you use either the edit specifiers or the visible specifiers um yeah okay so that's it for this episode thanks for watching and hopefully seeing you in the next episode